Hi Scorpios, welcome back to I Enigma Scorpio channel. This is Enigma. Let's do your reading. This is going to be a general reading for you all. This is a message everybody needs to hear. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, Sun, Mercury, Sun, and Scorpio are dealing with one. Since this is a general message, so take what resonates and leave what does not resonate. For more personals, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email for personal readings and more accuracy. I do all types of white prayer based spells for your highest good. We have energized, pure, high vibrational, intention charged crystals available of the best grade quality, and they're supercharged by me. So check out more reels on my Instagram, follow my Instagram as well as the recent September horoscopes. Check out my main channel, iEnigma, where I've recently done Scorpio read and other sign readings. If you know Hindi, don't forget to subscribe to my Hindi channel as well. And in the end of the day, yes, iEnigma Scorpio, like, share, comment and subscribe to this channel in the end. Now let's see the messages for you, Scorpio. What do you need to know right now? Mm hmm. Okay, wow. Didn't expect this. Now let's see what is happening. All right. So we have the Nine of Wands. We have the Queen of Cups. We have the Star. We have the Nine, nine of Swords, yes. And then we have the Moon. We have the Death. We have the Four of Pentacles. We have the Hierophant. Okay. Page of Cups. Oh my gosh. The Sun. The Judgment. The King of Pentacles. Wheel of Fortune. Your life is changing, Scorpio being in this disappointing connection to being in a most fulfilling love relationship marriage whatever you can call it your new beginning is right about to happen it's right around the corner and you wanted this so much you wanted this to the core i feel like there is someone that is below your league somewhere i feel like this person doesn't see themselves fit for you there is someone that keeps feelings for you strong feelings but they know that you will never agree to them because they're not on the same page as you are for some of you this person is way too younger than you someone is depressed because they think that it's not possible to have the scorpio in my life so they're not even reaching out to you they're deciding to cut the you know expectation stop expecting or reaching out to you in any way or form uh yes there is someone that feels anxious when you're around there's someone that feels nervous, but they're not telling you that they're in love with you, okay? But what I'm seeing right now, Scorpio, you don't even want to know if someone that you're not going to accept, you don't want to know whether this person likes you or not. Your major focus is on having that one person in your life without struggle and then ending up for the lifetime with that person. It is happening real soon. Give it some time, like, see, time is fluid. It could happen. For some of you, it's already happening. For some of you, it may happen anytime soon. So, just chill, relax, because you're heading towards a positive transformation in your life. Things are changing. Commitment is coming. And I'm seeing even in your workplace, you're going to put extra efforts and that uh, X factor that you have that only you have in the whole, you know, lot in, in the whole batch, wherever you're studying or wherever you're working, that X factor, that extra you're going to put in your work. So your work is highly appreciated. I'm seeing you getting uh, laurels in future whatever you work on you will get the results over it you will receive a lot more okay you will get recognition you will be paid more okay you will get a higher position uh power with it so a lot of things are coming into your life which brings happiness and new beginning and there is uh an energy inside of you there's a boost of energy that you feel and you're so happy that you're able to take care of your health also it's not affecting you mentally physically emotionally anymore because things have started to resolve in your life you've stopped getting attached to things that are toxic and that does not mean any good to you in the long term 
okay so i'm seeing someone virgo taurus capricorn very strongly coming in libra or leo or sagittarius pisces aquarius someone new a scorpio cancer but someone completely new that is coming into your life that is fit for you you could meet this person through work they are successful they are rich they are doing well in their life with rich i do not mean like you you are a gold digger or something with rich i'm trying to say this person is secure and safe and successful and will help you they have power okay so you meet this person on the same page right six of swords and the fool you have been putting yourself in a difficult situation okay because of the people that did not want to commit to you or who are giving you mixed signals but life has changed you're you you will be surprised that someone is coming towards you all by themselves on their own they're not like you're not the one that's reaching out to them you're not the one that's sending hints it's just happening to you naturally someone is coming towards you naturally with an offer of love scorpio pisces cancer aquarius all right okay you can expect the past person trying to reach out and you turning them down or there's someone that feels like they're not good enough for you will give one shot but they will be they will feel like a failure like a loser because you will say no to them okay maybe this is a pisces that's trying to reach out you're paying more attention to your work you're coming off as mysterious aloof because you have dreams and goals that you want to achieve the one that you turn down may try to get your attention by doing some drama so try to avoid that situation try to avoid that person try to avoid that drama okay talk less talk limited stay aloof stay mysterious stay uh am i okay because there is someone that is thinking that if they can't have you they can definitely confuse you there is someone that is definitely thinking like that okay if they are younger than you especially queen of wands they are attracted towards you and you are also becoming more and more attractive with time your aura oh my god it radiates power it radiates beauty it radiates that you're so attractive so powerful and good looking glow up there's a glow up and your body so i think that you're taking good care of yourself it does not matter what your weight is or height is you just look amazing your aura shines through so yes this is disappointing them because they don't think they're fit for you but at the same time you're becoming more and more and more attractive you're carrying an invisible crown everywhere you go someone is coming towards you passionately okay they could be coming in october if you haven't met them yet then they're coming in the month of october but whoever this is they are coming towards you passionately they could be october born but yes there is passion here i feel this is someone that is looking for stability okay that's looking for marriage that's looking for a long term commitment kids if your age allows this is someone that is already like very successful has a house has everything like they're sorted in life and i feel they're looking for settling down so that's the person that's coming towards you you might be this person after some hidden trials or this could be a your friend's friend that's how you're meeting them for some of you it is like you're meeting this person in a social setup this person is a loner or a lone wolf they like to go around alone they have a lot of ideas going around in their mind they're very intelligent they're a uh they could be a scholar okay they have a lot of guidance to give they inspire a lot of people so they're a name actually a lot of people know and respect them for some of you it could be a professor or it could be someone in law at a high grade high position whatever they do they're at a high position in life so they're not the one that will think or oh, that will create drama in your life okay so there's possibility a very strong possibly a very strong uh, chance that you guys are meeting through work okay in a setup in a professional setup 
could be a verbal that you're attracting this is someone that's coming from a long distance they don't live in your city or your country but they keep visiting you the magician it's like it's like universe opening a door of miracle like you never expected this this will happen when you least expect it okay that's how this will happen this could be a libra gemini aquarius you will not expect that this is going to happen in your life but this is happening they're coming towards you they're talking to you they're making efforts they're trying to get to know you they're exchanging numbers with you and you will be in awe like all of this is happening right in front of you three of swords Six of Wands, Seven of Wands. I'm sensing you're pushing this person away initially. You have trust issues with them or you think, oh my gosh, this person is very different from me. I can't. Initially, you might push this person away or you may tell them that, oh, I'm not ready right now because I've been hurt in the past. Something will happen like that. This might hurt them for the moment because they might feel rejected, but this will only increase their uh, respect towards you because you told the truth. And because of which, they're going to come falling all over you. Like, this person is going to fall head over heels because of this thing. You will say something. I don't know. When they reach out to you, you will say something from the depth of your heart, from the core of your heart that will touch them deep. And this will make them fall in love with you and confirm that they want to be with you. It might take some time as well. But yes, you will say something that will make them sure that they want to be with you yeah you're trying to you're trying to release someone from the past that's the i feel your past person does miss you but you don't want to go back because it's an unfinished business they could be from a different religion but you're done with that very soon i feel there is a part of you that has not yet forgiven your ex because they cheated on you they hurt you you have not really forgiven you've not really moved on so when this person comes into your life, you'll finally move on from that. All of that drama that has been going on. Yes, this is a new person. This is a new lover. Not the past. You're finally letting go of the past. Scorpio. There you go. See? There is someone that knows that they're not fit for you, but they're in love with you. But you're not taking them. You're rejecting them. Okay. bad health marriage some of you are taking too much stress regarding when i will get married or when will i find the perfect match for myself just chill relax everything is going to happen when you least expect it or when you least bother about it you need to chill okay so what i'm seeing is if your health is good if you're looking good if you're taking good care of yourself you'll definitely attract a lot of matches where you can make a choice and I'm also seeing universe wants you to pay more focus and attention towards your work. Hard work is going to pay off. Pathway, you're meant to go forward in life, grow in life. And you, in your career, there's a humongous amount of success that you will be achieving. So proper planning and having the detailed knowledge of your work is something you have to keep updating yourself with. That's all the universe is saying. Some of you 35, 33, 38, 31 okay or it could be anyone from any age financial constraints you might feel like the money is not increasing despite of you trying a lot the money is just not increasing don't worry you have to set proper strategy proper plans you have to go system wise you have to streamline your work okay so that is something very important and not get your health affected for any reason rest you can give it to god you've done your work now give it to god yes stay natural stay real that's how people will like you and appreciate you and especially your new love some of you are too worried about your love life that you're not paying attention to your money that's also not good okay leadership you're meant to be the boss you're meant to be the leader some of your teachers here and you do really good when it comes to children and teaching or children involved in some way or animals involved in some way you're a really good mentor so maybe that's a hint for you some of you are working uh, for airlines there's some sort of a traveling business 
even in that case you can do really well teaching or traveling something to do with children children's health charity social work this all will be very good for you if you're already thinking about it or if you make a lot of money please do some charity pakara buttercup so if you're feeling like stressed out sad not wanting to enjoy right now for the moment it could be because of something that you're not able to let go of it's a past hurt that you need to let go of scorpio please what is in the past will leave and you really have people around you that want to take care of you that want to help you that want to offer you a lot you know whenever you need them they will be by your side you might meet this person through a friend circle but i'm definitely seeing that there's someone that is extremely loyal even you can trust your friends these days everything is just going well yes your loved ones are completely safe someone is cancer that really cares for you respects you and loves you and look at the bigger picture if things are not currently good it will be in the long run what are you doing to make those changes that is what you need to focus today so some of you this could be a sagittarius that's coming in your connection with a sagittarius is going to improve if it has not been yet okay then we're having failure freedom you guys have stopped worrying about failing okay so i'm also sensing the more confused you are the more you know a uh, random you do things the less planning you do over the uh, things that you want to achieve the more disappointments you will face i know you like your freedom and you know you want to go with free will and you want to go with the flow but it is very important to stay focused and not get continuously confused sometimes you're doing something else sometimes you're doing something else that's not how you will achieve your goal so in order to minimize the possibility of losing or failing uh proper planning or strategy is very important so that you don't stay confused whenever you're wondering like what should i do to achieve this or what should i do to achieve that please write it down because you already know the answer you're just ignoring that scorpio if you like this reading do not forget to like share subscribe and comment in the end comment down let me know what part of this is resonating the most yes something to do with forgiveness letting go you are finally learning to let go and become the leader in life become the caretaker and not you're not the one that's going to crib in the corner anymore you're the one that's going to help people or help the ones near you so you might get the position of a manager or leader or a head position head of the organization or something this is what you will be getting so stay focused over your goals and release what bothers you because it's not yours anymore what is in the past is not yours four of swords right now it's time for you to take it slow one step at a time relax and have as much rest as you can some of you are going through some burnout that is why you need more rest this is what the universe is saying try to indulge in other activities also if you've been bored of the monotony in your life because you do have multiple opportunities for you to take and enjoy you know learning maybe you're going for a hobby like a gym or a dance class cooking classes or you're doing some new things you're knitting you're cooking or anything like that you're buying a new car or you're going to an event or something do some you know make some changes like that you need to keep going here and there a little bit like uh, you know uh taking a break and having an unusual experience all the time so this will really excite you so i'm also seeing someone is rushing towards you with passion and desire randomly when you least expect it okay so i'm also seeing you getting a lot of love offers if you're online but you're not interested in any of these in the end of the day scorpio is a scorpio you're a winner so i wish you all the best i wish you the luck i wish you all the things you want get manifested and do not forget to claim 
by liking, subscribing, and sharing, and commenting. Show some love. I'll see you back again. Please take care of yourself. Bye-bye.